I actually did feel very guilty. I had a lot of inner conflict for many years when I first began the sport. I felt that I was maybe going against my religion and it really, really used to tear me apart. At the same time, I loved the sport and I couldn't understand how that could be wrong. I realised that I was living in a double life. You know, one that was a nice traditional girl at home and the other where I used to come to the gym and that was another side of me. Initially, when I first began, I actually kept it hidden from my family simply because I was afraid that this sport would come to an end for me. This was the one sport that mentally and physically made me concentrate and stay focused every single second that I was in the ring. I think people find it quite shocking that someone of my background and someone who's quite tiny and petite female actually steps into the ring and handles myself. When you're in training mode, you're in training. He doesn't care. He doesn't care about excuses. It doesn't matter I'm a young female. He'll train me as hard as he trains some of the big heavyweights. Knees. Elbow, elbow. Elbow, elbow. Elbow. Hands up, focus on me. It's full speed, full pace, full power, and it's one of the hardest sports in the world, so it can be quite intimidating. It's taught me so much. Talent alone is not enough. It's all about sacrifice. It's all about being dedicated. And it's never the end until you give up.